You're watching Vancouver TV, where we show you what's happening in your city. We've got the latest movie reviews and access to your favorite celebs. From fashion to red carpets, live shows, and more, we cover it all, keeping you informed about your city and in the know about upcoming events. Nothing says the holidays quite like family. I wasn't expecting you for another day or two. Your room's upstairs. But the liquor's in the dining room. Baby, baby, hey, Walter. Is the family coming for Christmas? Every single one of them. Rachel, Rachel, Rachel. So where's your husband? Ex-husband. Oh. Hey, Rachel. You know he's single. Okay, mama. So sorry about your loss. The African-American woman is the backbone of the black family. Who is this white man? What's up with those pink pants, Malibu Barbie? <laughs> they gonna kill each other out there. Uh-oh, somebody got a boyfriend. I got vibrators older than that child. Get it to me! You burned the macaroni! It was gonna be disgusting. I did you a favor. Do me a damn favor. Don't burn down the damn house. Oh, God, oh, God. Oh. What the hell did y'all do? You can't afford to buy me no more outfits like this. This is my Chaka Khan. Chaka Khan. Chaka Khan. All I'm asking is for five days, the all to act like a family. You all should feel like a bunch of dumbasses. Just gonna blow my buzz. If I close my eyes, I can see mom in here like it was yesterday. She is here. She's in every pot, in every pan. We are standing on holy ground. My husband's gonna kill himself. Nothing like positive reinforcement for the holiday. That's not good. Come on, Santa Claus. Time to go get them ho ho hoes. Did you find everything you need? Sometimes you find things that you're not even looking for. Stuffing, baby. Boy, I'm a grown ass woman. I'ma stab your ass with this fork. Do you hear me? I would love that. Well, at least we know it can't get any worse. Lonnie? Oh my god. Oh my god. You two know each other? Mm-hmm. Oh shit. Oh, 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 oh my god. What the hell is going on? I'm his wife, you dumb bitch. Who are you calling a dumb bitch? You, you dumb bitch, young bitch, silly bitch, dead bitch. She got the gun, bitch. <laughs> Lonnie, if you're gonna bring bitches in here, bring a smart bitch. I'm too old for this. To win tickets to see this movie and other fun movie price packs, visit www.vancouvertelevision.ca. Hey VTV viewers, it's Christine White, your reigning Miss Vancouver 2015-2016. I'm here backstage with the band Kala Lily, who just flew in from the Philippines. How are you guys doing? We're great. We've been having a good time. Awesome. How about you? I'm good. Um, just chilling. Yeah. How was the flight? Yeah, flight is a long flight. Then, but it's okay. Yeah. You guys feeling jet lagged? Uh, I, I don't know. I mean, maybe it's hitting me already. But this is the farthest we've, you know, we've been like as a band in Canada. We're, we're happy. We're, we feel, we're, we feel blessed. We're here. Awesome. Well, welcome Thank to Vancouver. Know. With Miss Vancouver, the <laughs> raining Miss Vancouver. Yeah. Well, I'm very sorry that it's raining today, but hopefully you'll come back when it's nice and sunny and summery. Well, you don't have to be sorry. I mean, we love it. We're Canadian. We always apologize. Yeah, we love it. I mean, oh really? Is that yeah. your thing? Really? Yeah. Uh, well, I didn't know. That's our stereotype, anyways. Oh really? Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> no need to apologize. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, so um, we're about to hit the stage very soon. So yeah. can you tell us um, how you feel about that? I'm thrilled. Though, you know, there's this mixed emotions. You know, I'm happy I'm here. It's my first time here in Canada. First time to play in front of our um, Filipino um, community here. You know. Um, I'm I'm thrilled. I, I'm, I can't wait to play with the unsung band. I can't wait to see our dear Kababayans. I, I mean, I'm, I'm pretty sure there's going to be an experience to like, remember. Most definitely, and I know you have a lot of fans here. Really? That's what I hear anyways. Those are my siblings, all of them. <laughs> 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 you have a big family then. <laughs> well, thank you, thank you. We appreciate it. You know, like what I said, it's, it's Raincouver, right? I mean, and you guys are... Pouring us so much love. We appreciate it. Thank you. We, 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 we love being here. Love being here. The, the nicest people. Oh, well, thank you. We're pouring in the love with that rain. Um, so could you tell us a little bit about your instrument that you play? Yeah, I'm the guitar player of Cali. 
and I'm gonna share the stage with Kian as an acoustic player. That's okay. it. Very nice. So, um, how did the bat start? Well, we started way back in high school. Really? Me and Tatsi, we were like, we were schoolmates. Like, we were high school buddies. Mm -hmm. And there's this band I was in, and they kicked me out. Uh -huh. Kicked me out. So, um, it, it was heartbreaking for me. I was, what, 13, 14? So, that's when I decided I want to I wanna build my own band. And then I talked to Tatsi, who was just playing the keyboard back then. I'm like, come on, let's 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 put up a band. And then we asked for like, um, we, we asked our classmates, who was up. And then then we did it. And then a few years later, after high school, Tatsi called me. Like he's like, hey, I have a gig for us. This is cool. This is Merix. It's it's a it's a legit bar in the Philippines. Well, it's it's gone, but uh, it was a it was a place for like bands where, where all those famous mm -hmm. bands used to play mm -hmm. and we're like oh yeah, yeah let's do it I mean Merix come on let's play but the thing is we, we don't have a band it's just <laughs> you and me so I called Aaron up like come on let's 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 do it let's do Kala Lily and play our original songs we have a gig but we don't have bandmates come on let's do it play the bass and then yeah he was he was really up for it so um, he asked his <laughs> other friends to like join us with Lem um, our drummer who's not here. Mm -hmm. um, so it's Alden, our, our former guitar player. So, so we just we just did it. it. It was supposed to last for like just one gig, but we had fun. We we wrote more songs. We hung out more. So yeah, we're it's it's our eleventh year now. So wow. yeah, and, and the rest is history. We we were signed up. Um, two thousand seven, two thousand five, we formed the band. Two thousand six, we were signed. Um, by a label and then we released our first single first music video and the rest is history okay. and now we have like five albums already wow. so everything's pretty cool yeah congratulations on all your achievements Okay, could one of you tell me what is the meaning behind your band name? Well, Kala Lily is a flower. You know, it's, it's a beautiful flower. It's a flower of love and death. It's, it's, it's a flower used in... Yeah, yeah, that's, that's how we see it. It's, it's, a, it's a flower used in weddings. And it's also used in like, funerals. So it's love and death. It's like our music. You know? it's, it's about, you know, heartbreaks and being happy and friendship and relationships and, you know, all those things. Life. Loving this. <laughs> um, so, could you tell us a little bit about um, your future endeavors? Whoa. Oh, um. We want to. Uh, uh, we really want to tour the world. That's yeah. all we want to do. Like, um, we just want to be heard, like, all over the universe. Mm -hmm. You know, because <laughs> we just love playing music. So yeah. we'll, we'll keep on writing songs. We'll keep on um, recording albums, and we'll keep on playing live gigs and hang out with our fans and improving as a musician yeah. yes and keep on learning and you yeah. know. More, more albums and maybe you know like there's we, we believe in expansion of art so like like us we do a lot of different things mm -hmm. like we do things together we do things separately like Tatsi Tatsi and I we own a business in the Philippines we own a restaurant it's called Conchos it's the home of seasick goodness okay. uh, yeah it's it's you're gonna love it when you go to the Philippines, yeah. yes, please do. When you when you go to the yeah. Philippines in, in when December, December, December? yeah, yes. you should try it. Um, and um, I direct too, like music videos and short films, and eventually, I'm hoping, wishing, praying, direct my own full length film. Yeah. Um, Aaron's a wakeboarder. Uh, oh. Lem, Lem owns a our, our drummer. He owns a chocolate factory. So oh, we love wow. doing things like on our own. But at the end of the day. We look for each other. Come on, let's play music. Let's write songs. And, and there's Kala Lily. You know, mm. it's, maybe that's why we exist. <laughs> that's great. Now, do you have a message or maybe a motto for our viewers at home that want to also start a band? Um, just keep on doing it. Just keep <laughs> keep on doing it. Practice. Have faith. Um, lo love what you do. Love every every chord you play. Like, and um, in putting up a band, 
it's important that you, you adjust and you you respect the people you play with because mm -hmm. you know if the music is right there but with respect you're gonna go a long way long way and tune your guitars maybe tune yeah. your guitars yeah. tune your guitars yeah change strings from time to time <laughs> yeah and write more songs Ex um, express do not impress mm -hmm. that's a motto yeah. that's a good motto express do not impress yeah, yeah. so Okay, guys, I'm going to put you on the spot and ask you some questions that maybe the fans at home have wondered okay. about. Okay. Shoot it. Favorite color? Green. If black's a color, then black, but I like green too. Okay. Like white. White. Okay, favorite number? 12. Mine is 7. Mine is 3. What's your favorite number? I like 10. Okay, most embarrassing moment of your life? Oh, man. Um. Um, when my my pants get ripped off, <laughs> oh, oh, no. I was playing during a gig. Yeah, yeah. Oh man, that's it. Okay, Kian. That's mine. Go, Tatsi. Okay, Tatsi. Actually, uh, I was walking inside the mall and uh, I bumped my head in a clear glass <laughs> with many people. So boom. Yeah, that's, that's it. Uh, yeah, uh, that happens to me a lot. A lot. A lot? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Do you need glasses? Uh, yeah, I, I think. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. okay, Ken. Well, th there's this one gig, and I and I tripped off the stage, like super. I, I was really, I was really down there. And everyone's like, "How's how's Key and how's the singer? How's the singer?" <laughs> oh my gosh, because I know you jump around on stage yeah, a lot, so it's it's hard because you don't know how to redeem yourself. You know, maybe that's that's embarrassing. I don't know if it's the most embarrassing thing that ever happened to me, but it is embarrassing. Cool. Okay. Well, I think that's it for today, guys. Thank you so Thank much. You. Thank you. This song is called Stars. It's our first single ever. Stars. Three, two, one. And. picture of you reminds me how the years have gone so lonely And why do you have to leave me without saying that you love me? I'm saying I love you again, are you listening? Open your eyes once again, look at me crying if only you could hear me shout your name If only you could feel my love again The stars in the sky will never be the same If only you were here A picture of you reminds me how my days have gone so empty And why do you have to leave me without saying that you love me? I'm saying I love you again Are you listening? 
Open your eyes once again Look at me crying If only you could hear me shout your name If only you could feel my love again The stars in the sky will never be the same If only you were here I'm saying I love you again Are you listening? Open your eyes once again Look at me crying If only you could hear me shout your name If only you could feel my love again The stars in the sky will never be the same If only I had wings so I can fly I wanna be with you for all of time My love for you will never die If only you could hear me shout your name If only you could feel my love again the stars in the sky will never be the same If only you were here If only you were here Hi, we're Kala Lily, and you're watching Vancouver Television. Yay! Yeah. Peace. Hey, VTV viewers, it's Christine White, and I'm here backstage with Miss Viveka, who flew in from the Philippines. How are you? I'm so good, amazing, great. Hmm? <laughs> hello, hello to our fellow Filipinos here in Vancouver. So how was the flight? Oh, my God. Um, it's like uh, I have like uh, less sleep because... I watched like uh, four movies during the flight and I so enjoyed it. <laughs> That's I'm awesome. always like that. I'm always like that. That's awesome. So did you even sleep yet? Um, I slept already like uh, six hours. That's I'm good. it. I'm good. I'm good. You're good. You're good. Okay. I can perform. <laughs> we know that you can perform. That's the thing. So what can we expect tonight on the theater stage? Of course, um, we're going to do our very best to uh, per, uh, perform and uh, entertain everybody here in Massey Theater. And um, we're going to promise you like uh, laughter, um, a quality performance. Of course, with, with Miss Casey Tandingan, one of our great uh, singers back in the Philippines. And of course, Kian Cipriano, mm -hmm. a very handsome guy and very talented. Mm -hmm. So watch out for that. And of course, our two, um, what you call that, youngsters. Yes, our, 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 it's an, what you call that, upcoming artist yeah. uh, from ABS-CBN. That's amazing. Yeah, I can't look, I, I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> um, so, my dear, can you tell us a little bit about your history? How did you start this whole career as a performer? I started as a uh, stand-up comedian. I sang at comedy bars every night, way, way back. And then I, uh, I've been to Japan also as a solo performer. And I've been to Malaysia with a band. And then when I come home, uh, I do usually my gigs, yeah, as a comedian, as a host every night. Mm -hmm. And then eventually, one day, <laughs> um, one of the blessings that uh, uh, made the, me an actress, so they say, in the Philippines, I've started, you know, um, a bit player, a bit, a bit roller. That's what they call it. Mm -hmm. My first teleserie was, um, what, uh, Betty La Fea, I'm one of the, um, what you call this, um, contestant uh, on the serie with uh, Miss Bea Alonso. Mm -hmm. And then after that, um, more, more series and then different kind of roles also. But my biggest break was be careful with my heart. Mm -hmm. That made me, uh, you know, made me go, go to places, different places, been to America also. Oh, nice. I just... I am, I'm very surprised and I don't know, I, I'm really so overwhelmed, you know, being a maid in a teleserie, mm -hmm. 
it made me go places, promise. I am so uh, thankful and grateful to what happened to me. And until now, I am still so, you know, like, it's like a dream come true. Mm. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. um, ten years ago, I started as a uh, stage performer, as a stand-up comedian. I do hosting, I sing also. And um, after that, been to Japan as a solo performer. And been to Malaysia also with uh, a band. And then when I go back to the Philippines, I always go to, I go back to my uh, passion uh, as a uh, stand-up comedian every night. I do gigs. And then eventually, uh, a, a director saw me and then he hired me on my very first teleserie. That is Betty Lafea, way, way back. And uh, I played the role as Eileen, one of the friends of Miss Betty Lafea, uh, Miss Bea Alonso on that serie. And then after that, I've uh, been playing more roles. And then eventually, my biggest break was Be Careful With My Heart. I played the role as Sabel, one of the maids inside the house, uh, the mansion of uh, Sir Chief and Maya. Uh, that launched my career. And I'm so grateful until now. It really works, you know. I've been to America, been to places like uh, yeah, Vancouver, uh, had the chance to go back to Japan again, but not as a solo performer, but with them, with, uh, with the whole cast, having our uh, Be Careful With My Heart tour. And until now, I'm so enjoying what I'm doing. And um, I'm recently taping this uh, serie, Langit Lupa, that's the title, but we're not airing yet, but we're taping, yeah. So uh, please do stand by and watch out for it. Keep on dreaming, yeah. Pursue, chase your dream, and uh, improve your craft. And always be grateful. Don't forget where you came from. Always, uh, you know, put your feet on the ground. <laughs> My name is Viveka Ravanes, and you are watching Vancouver Television. Hey, VTV viewers, it's Christine White here, and I'm standing beside JK, who just flew in from the Philippines. How are you? I am fine. Yeah, I'm good. How about you? I'm very good. Thank you. I can't wait to see you perform on stage. Oh, yeah. Okay, so what are we going to expect from you on the stage? Oh, you're going to expect some uh, performances, which should be really good, because I'm going to perform not just me, but with uh, Kian Cipriano, Casey Tandingan, Viviaca Viviaca, and uh, uh, Ella. So, yeah, you're going to expect a lot of things, a lot of songs. I'm going to do some cover songs. Uh, I'm going to also sing some Tagalog songs for the Filipino audience, because I think there's going to be some Filipino audience watching. So, yeah. yeah, the majority, I think, are from oh, yeah, Filipinos. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, that's sweet. You have a lot of fans. Yeah, some nostalgic songs. Yeah, I'm going to sing some of that. Oh, nice. Could you give us a sample? Oh, yeah. Here, I'm going to sing the Tagalog song. Tayo ay matanda na Sana'y di tayo magbago Kailanman Nasan may ito ang pangarap ko? Yeah, that's some Tagalog song. It's a really a famous song in the Philippines. Yeah, it's about uh, love. Like, even if you get old, I'll we'll still love you the same. Yeah, sweet song. Nice. Can't wait to see the full performance. Okay, I want to ask about the, the voice kids. How yeah, was sure. that experience? Oh, yeah, it was fun. It was fun. And have you, have you ever experienced a uh, feeling some mixed emotions like you're happy all the time yeah <laughs> yeah like just mixed like you're happy but then you're kind of sad like you're confident but you're kind of shy yeah so it was a show a show full of mixed emotions really like you know we made this word uh nervous sided yeah confident nervous and excited mm -hmm. we made that up and it, it, it was really what we felt yeah, it was it was it was fun. I bet all. because how old were you when you were on that stage? Thirteen. It, and it, guess what? It is my first performance ever, like first competition really? ever. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Because some people like have this uh, thingy, like school things mm -hmm. and stuff. It was my first thing, first time performing on stage with people. Yeah. So 
I was under pressure that time, but I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. Yeah. yeah. That's amazing. Well, good on you. I hope you will continue with music because you're very talented. Oh yeah. Thank yeah. You, thank yeah. You, thank you. Yeah. Thank you, JK. Oh, yeah. Thank you too. Hi. How do you Bye. deal with all the attention, like, like right there, sorry, now, whether that be negative or positive? Uh. Well. Uh, I'm always flattered. Like, I, I, I feel so happy when, yeah. When people notice me, like, "Hey, you're J.K." Oh, wow, that's that. that yeah, it's really sweet, though. Seriously, uh, I feel so uh, blessed because, like, it, it's been my dream to do um, to join showbiz and stuff like that. So yeah, it's coming true, and yeah, I feel flattered and happy with that. Yeah, yeah. That's an example of some attention right there. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Like we're serious here, and yeah, she's like, and then she's just there, yeah. "Hashtag J.K." Yeah, this is like <laughs> Just a moment of happiness, a moment of happiness.